my name is Jamie. Welcome to Border Bananas. Today I am sharing with you a teeny tiny thrift with me and a great big thrift haul. My mom was in town as well as, well as my sister and her family uh, for the holiday season for the Thanksgiving dinner and um, it was just a really busy and really fun week. Um, it was a great week. My mom and I did get out thrifting for a small business Saturday and we went to River Falls, Wisconsin. There's a store there that I love. It's called Treasures uh, from the Heart. It's an ad array and it, um, the money, the proceed goes to hospice, I believe. So, or the profits go to hospice, but it's a really great um, program and uh, they were having 50% off on that day. So we decided we were gonna head down there. Um, I love thrifting in River Falls. My mom loves thrifting in River Falls. It's just such a pretty little town and there's so many little, good little thrift shops down there. So, uh, but before I tell you that, um, <laughs> if you've been watching for the last little bit, you know that I Gabe and I went on a date. Gabe is my husband. We went on a date and we went thrifting and then we went to Lowe's and I was telling you how I was looking for a new Christmas tree, but they're so expensive. Costway must have seen that video because they contacted me and offered to send me a video. So um, I said yes and let me tell you the tree is beautiful. Um, it is a hinged tree um, and so it's just in three pieces plus this base and it was so easy to put together. There are some of those poly leaves or um, you know needles in it but they're way into the base of the tree not like the ones at Walmart I can't remember the ones I know the ones at Lowe's did have them as well but I can't remember if they were like closer to the edge or on the inside um, of the tree but these ones you can't even see unless you're looking deep into the tree so I was really excited about that because they just used it as a filler um, and then the outside branches all look so real the price of this tree was phenomenal too. I think it was like $150. I will definitely have it linked down below for you. It is a really nice tree. However, I started putting it together over in the corner of my living room and this tree is wide. It is much bigger than the last tree. Um, it's normal Christmas tree width. It's not like huge or anything, but it's much we have a tiny living room and it's much bigger than I expected it to be. It completely covered our, our TV and our couch had to be way out of place. So we decided to move it over into the uh, front of the picture window. It is a little off center in the window, but that's okay. Um, and uh, just decorated it with decorations they already had plus ribbon. We did inherit a few bird clips, Christmas ornaments when my father-in-law passed. So those are on there as well. Uh, but yeah, we, I didn't buy anything other than ribbon for the tree. So that's kind of nice. Um, and it is beautiful. So thank you Costway so much. I believe they have sent me a coupon for you if you are interested in that tree as well. And I will have that link down in the description box as well. Did I just repeat myself? I think I did. <laughs> okay. So then um, my main purpose, I have been working in my bathroom, um, doing a little project in there, just doing little, some little updates. And I was looking for a long skinny art piece to go kind of on, on my long wall in my bathroom. And I did find that, I will show it to you in a minute. It's one of the last things that I found. But the very first thing I found was from that Adderay's Treasures from the Heart, I believe is the name of the store. It's this vintage wool skirt. It was marked $12, marked vintage as well, and I love this thing. So it was 50% off, so I paid $6 for it and rounded up for Adderay. And I stinking love this. It, did I say it's already been washed? I, yes, I already washed it. It is a button skirt. It buttons all the way to end. It's lined. I love this thing so much. I would wear this. I would totally wear this with this turtleneck and a pair of black boots or a chunky sweater and some brown boots. Um, I think it is so cute. It is wool and lined, so it, it'll be nice and cozy if I just put some leggings on underneath with a pair of knee-high boots. Oh man, I think it'll be so cute. I love it 
so much and it just happened to be in my size so and it is all the way it goes it's not quite ankle I let me see I would say yeah it's ankle I just laid back in my bed to check <laughs> So there you go. Um, it is, oh, I love it so much. It is so beautiful. Then, oh, I should show you these guys first. When mom and my sister came, they brought me presents, you guys. And they told me I could show them to you guys because I know that you'll be just ex as excited about them as I am. So my sister and my mom um, brought me this Fire King Jadeite Dough Bowl or Batter Bowl, Batter Bowl. And I am so stinking excited. This was on my thrift list. There's only a couple more pieces that are on my thrift list. And I have not, I have yet to see them in the wild. So I am so excited about this. Oh, I love it so much. Thank you guys. And then they brought me two of my glass ornament tree, not ornament, um, bl hand blown trees. And this one has the green ribbing through it. Isn't it beautiful? Let's see if I can, yeah. You can kind of see the green ribbing through it. I love these so much. I had, <laughs> because you, if you put them in front of the light, they cast the light and they look so pretty and so wintry. I had um, a, many subscribers when I showed them in one of my home tours, they're like, oh, now I see why you love those trees so much. Cause they just cast light so beautifully and they're sturdy. I just, I love them. That is that one that they brought and then they brought me this one, which I don't have one like this. This one is like twisted and the, the um, branches are like pointing down, which I thought was really, really cool. So I, they brought me that one too. And then, um, okay, okay, so those are the gifts they brought me. Aren't they beautiful? I love them. Thanks mom. Thanks Jen. And then I, we went to the River Falls and got the skirt. And then we went to, I'm trying to think of what the next store was. The next store we went to was, I think it's called Marketplace on Main or Market on Main. I love that little shop. And my mom actually found another tree. <laughs> this Mamma Jammer is huge. Um, so this is like the normal size of a tree. So do you see how big that is? Isn't that cool? Um, I love it so much. And she paid $15 for that, for this, which I did not think was bad for this big tree, um, which is great. And it says it's from Global Art Made in Taiwan. So this one has the sticker on the bottom. So there's, what is that? Three trees, right? And then I went and saw this and I was like, ooh, I know what that is. And I went over to it and it is this. It's the Syracuse China Little Cream Pitcher. I love it so much. Uh, you know how I feel about my Syracuse China and I love this like powdery cornflower blue color. It's so, so pretty. I actually think I like this even more so than that deeper blue transfer wear color. Um, I, I just love the softer blue. Then let's see, we went to another store and it was, which one did we go to first? I think we went to uh, Second Second Chances, I think is the name of the store. And I found two books. I found, I always look for Christmas books and I'm very specific about my books. Well, I should say red books for Christmas. I want them to be a, like the right red. I want them to have gold lettering and an uplifting title. Um, but this one is really cool because this is actually the book of hymns. So it's full of hymns and it has this on the front and it's just going to be very pretty. It actually has the red pages as well. So, and this was $3. So that is a really fun find to add to my red book collection for my Christmas decor. And then um, we've been playing, my mom is a big, big time Scrabble player. She loves playing Scrabble and I didn't own Scrabble. Um, so we borrowed my daughter's and then I found this guy at that same store. It was $3 and it is, you can look up the Scrabble dictionary online, but it's so much easier. Just have the book with your game, right? 
So um, it was $3 and it is the official Merriam-Webster Scrabble Dictionary. So that was exciting for me because I, we were talking about looking for one and looking for a Scrabble book or a Scrabble game as well. Um, so then, oh my goodness, you guys, I found some good stuff. We went to uh, 125 on Main. And that is probably one of my favorite. I always find something really good there. And right when I walked in, they had all kinds of these everywhere. So I grabbed, they had all different colors. And when you see what they are, you'll know why I'm so excited because I love these so much. I picked up five of these guys and they are the, the vintage mercury glass ornaments. I picked up this one. These are the minis and I love it so, so much. I grabbed that one. They had pink and green and red, blue, like a minty color. Um, I just think they are so beautiful. And if you're wondering, YouTubers hold up things in front of their hands because the camera will focus on our face rather than on the object. And so that's why we do that. Um, so you can get a good um, look at these guys. So, and I grabbed that one and then I grabbed this one these were a dollar a piece and I did grab five of them and then this one as well aren't they pretty I love them so much and I, I just kind of want to collect a bowl of them you know <laughs> Then they had these. Oh my gosh, I was so excited. Um, I, they're all wrapped up so nicely. And um, I'm pretty sure these are vintage. They had several strands of them um, and they were all slightly different. Like they were all in different orders and stuff. So, oh, Odin's hearing something, but these are the large size. Aren't they pretty? I'm hoping that my camera is focusing. If not, I will definitely get you some footage of them closer, but they are so beautiful. I love them so much. Aren't they pretty? Just like that. Um, I should have grabbed another one because in the next house, we're going to have a fireplace. And I think it'd be pretty hanging down each side of the fireplace with some greenery. Ugh, so pretty. I forgot to mention that I picked up this print on at Second Chances. It's a signed print and it was $15. A couple more things to show you. We did go to Goodwill on our way home. That was our last stop. And I found a Scrabble board and a Scrabble. Um, it has all of the wood things. It is missing four letters, the E, G, N, and Y one of each of those letters. So I'm on the hunt for those. I love, I actually really love the old wooden letters. Um, so yeah, I, and this was $3, $2.99 at Goodwill. And I did pay full price because it was a Saturday. So, which I never go to Goodwill on Saturdays, but um, yeah, so I grabbed this guy. So we got, how lucky was that? <laughs> I was like, hey mom, let's just look for a Scrabble board. Um, probably not going to find them because people usually buy them for the letters, right? So uh, I was excited when they when I found it. Last but not least, for all of my purchases, oh, I did part purchase one more thing. I should go grab them for you. Um, but I found a bag of 21 of these guys for $4.99 and I am so excited, but vintage brass door pulls these guys this is six and a half inches and the back plate is five and a half inches and I just think they are so pretty and I grabbed these for my next house I have been pinning stuff I have a secret uh, Pinterest board of a uh, vision board for the next house and I have been um, pinning these um, 
an antique brass hardware and other enclosures um, for my next house. <clears throat> and this is very similar to what I wanted. I want the back plate on them. I think they're so pretty. I just love it so much. They do need cleaning up. They're pretty greasy and they do have a little bit of rust on them. And I cannot wait to do that. I love bringing stuff back to their beautiful original state. Um, even if I can't get them to the original state, I love the aged brass. Look, you guys know that about me. And I think they're beautiful. And it was 21 of these for $5. So, and they are the brand um, NLCO. And I did look them up online and I think you can get two of them for about five bucks on eBay. So, if I need to find more, I can. But 20 of them is not bad for five bucks. I was so excited. Now I just need to get the other parts for my upper cabinets. These will be for just the drawers. So I think I'm definitely gonna have enough for that. But This is the picture that I was uh, telling you about in the beginning of the video. It will be getting changed a little bit. I'm not loving the complete brass of it. Um, so let's now go thrifting for just a moment. That is what I found thrifting this week. I hope you guys had an amazing Thanksgiving week and um, happy holidays. It's the holiday season. Thank you guys uh, for spending a few of your moments with me. I know that they're not promised and I do appreciate you choosing to uh, spend a few of them with me. Thanks guys. Bye.